Local Republican Party office in ashes today after what authorities in one North Carolina town say was a firebombing. Joining us now on the phone, North Carolina Republican Party Executive Director Dallas Woodhouse. Um, Dallas, thank you so much for joining us today. We've got some pictures so folks can see what uh, it looks like inside. There was graffiti, I understand, painted on the outside as well, referring to, quote, Nazi Republicans. Uh, do you know if there had been threats there against any individual against that office? We are not aware of there being any threat. Um, we, uh, I am here on the scene now, and it is a very difficult situation. The, 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 the part that you didn't say is it says Nazi Republicans get out or else. So we have taken that. We need to warn all of our uh, GOP offices across all of the hundred counties in North Carolina. Um, we've recommended that they um, close by sundown tonight. Let us get sort of a handle on this situation. Mm -hmm. uh, but we will have all our offices up and running tomorrow. We are bringing in a mobile bus to this office because, I mean, this is an utter act of political terrorism. Well, I mean, the, the picture intimidate yeah, the, the pictures show a, a lot of destruction, and the good news was this was overnight and nobody was working. But as you and I have discussed uh, in the past, you know, during campaign season, people do often work overnight. Uh, the police say they're investigating. Do you have any clues, anything moving forward at this point? It's early on. We know, we know the uh, ATF and the feds were out here earlier today. I mean, I think the scariest part is the bomb hit sort of a couch and a chair where volunteers back out all the time, and it's just a great to God that nobody was there. Um, the, the, the office is a total loss, voter list, everything else, but that's not the important thing. The important thing is nobody was killed. Uh, people could have been killed. It, it's a very, just a horrifying situation when you think you have volunteers and offices all across the state in, in, in all kinds of places, and, and I mean, and, and, and these kind of acts are intended to intimidate. They are intended to terrorize. That's what they are. And, um, but we, 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 will, we will not let it happen. Well, Dallas, we know that you all have said you're going to keep moving forward and keep working. Um, we wish you the best and that this investigation will lead to the perpetrator uh, very quickly. In the meantime, uh, stay safe and we'll follow the investigation. Thanks, Dallas. Yeah, we'll have updates on our state party website. Thank you very much. All right, we'll check it out. Thank you.